a 20-year-old woman who lives in Montreal by the name of Brenda Aubin Vega quite possibly will qualify for the foolishness of forever with what she has done. Now, Brenda, on a break from work, went and bought one of those scratchy lottery tickets and won. She had a choice to make it. She could have one million dollars. Mind you, these are Canadian dollars. They're not real, but there's still a million of them. <laughs> or she could have 1,000 fake Canadian dollars every week for the rest of her life. And she took the thousand a week. Poor Brenda is the dumbest person I've ever heard of. She's 20. And it's going to take 20. 19 years, give or take, to get 1 million in cash. But if she invested the million that she got, it would take yeah. 13 years to get a million off Right. The first million, which would give her two million. And then right. it would take another six years to get three million. And on and on and on. There's a fly in the ointment. This is Canada. Uh -huh. So her marginal tax rate's probably 70% or something. It might well be, but it's also Canada. And that $1,000 a week isn't going to sound like much in 20 years. Because inflation is going to chip away at, at that price year in after year after year. I think if you're trusting a government to pay you for the rest of your life, you've probably made a tactical error. You're always better off getting all your money up front.